Are you planning a staycation this summer? Then it is time to kick back, relax, and take in a show. The Chesapeake Shakespeare Company performs on a beautiful outdoor stage in Old Ellicott City. The performances are even family friendly. And here to tell us more about it is Managing Director of the company, Leslie Malin. Welcome. Thanks, Elsa. I'm happy to be here. I'm happy to have you here, too, because I've been meaning to go here. It looks beautiful. Tell us a little bit more about the company. It's gorgeous um, out there at um, mm -hmm. the PFI Historic park in Ellicott yes. City where we have been performing for this is our 17th season out there just amazing it and is. the company itself what what is our so we are Maryland's Shakespeare company <laughs> and we perform Shakespeare and other classics and yes. for the last five years we've had a home in downtown Baltimore mm -hmm. um, but every summer we come back home to Ellicott City where we started yes and so what sorts of plays have you had in the past and what can we look forward to this summer um, well we mostly do Shakespeare outside because mostly uh, outdoor Shakespeare is something that people really love yes. to see. Um, and Taking it back to the roots. <laughs> indeed, because Shakespeare himself performed outside. Yes, yes. Um, so we, we love being out there. It's a gorgeous um, old uh, 19th century building. It's just the ruins of it that have been stabilized. And then there's about five acres of park around it. And we build a stage up against the walls and we bring in chairs and lights and people come by the hundreds and thousands. Wow. By hundreds and thousands is really that large. That you well, we, we can seat about 250. Believe it or not, but the fire marshal shows. says yeah. that we can't we have more than 250. Well, yeah, I'm always like, don't you just run away? <laughs> <laughs> and you want to be close enough that you can hear, but you have yes. that many shows that you get that yes. many people Yes, attending. we have several thousand people. Yes. Uh, it's it's uh, historic Ellicott City's signature season event. And you have Love's Labor's Lost. That's coming up right now, right? That's right. So that's one of Shakespeare's uh, wonderful romantic comedies. Okay. And this one is about um, the King of Navarre and three of his uh, best friends decide that they are going to um, only study and pray for three years and see no women at all. Oh, but sad instead, for them. Dead, the Princess <laughs> of France arrives with her three ladies and will you you can just imagine what happens now, then. I'm assuming they changed their minds. I, I don't do. know this one. No, a lot of people don't. It's not done a whole lot, but it's a lot of yes. fun. And we've said it in sort of 1920s F. Scott Fitzgerald oh. land. And so everybody is looking very, uh, very dashing. Well, see, I like that because you, you switch it up. Absolutely. So you can you take an older play, you take a Shakespearean play, and then you can put it in different times. Absolutely. Sets. It's a lot of fun. It's just sort of a ways into the story. Well, that's cool. And then also cool is that you have family fun, family fun days because of all the activities. Tell me more about that. Right. So um, we have every Sunday is family fun day. So uh, the show is at six o'clock. And before that, we have games. We have an actor coming out and telling the story of the play for kids. There's coloring activities. There's face painting. Painting, and then at intermission, the kids are invited to come up on stage and um, do a maypole dance. Oh wow! <laughs> it's like, so what it's age really group just are controlled we talking chaos. About? Yeah. <laughs> What age group are we talking about here? How young, how old is there a... You know, we offer free admission for kids up to age 18. We think it's really, really? important to get kids in to see live Shakespeare before yeah. the schools get hold of them. That is true. <laughs> and so it's quite extraordinary because you can have... I've, I've seen three-year-olds like stand right up on, on the foot of the stage and just watch for an entire act and they never move. Um, it just depends on your own kid. Yes, I mean, it really, it's such a great idea to introduce them to Shakespearean plays right there as a family outside in a fun environment as opposed to, eh, I just read it in English class and now I have to perform it. That's it, you terrible, know? that's no fun. <laughs> and it's a great thing for families because they don't have to get a babysitter. It yes. costs a whole lot less money for them to bring their kids. Right. If they've got, they can bring a picnic and right. save money that way. Well, you've already sold me, plus it's, it's um, old Ellicott City. It is. So like right down there. I mean, talk about that environment, exactly where you are. Right. So we are on a hill overlooking Ellicott City. Yes. And uh, down below is Main Street Ellicott City, and it's still got 70 shops yes. and restaurants still going. So there's plenty to do oh, before. Know. Go a little antique hunting before the show. Go get a drink in downtown Ellicott City after the show. Yes, downtown Ellicott City gets all my money all of the time. So <laughs> thanks for being here. Love's Labor's Loss is playing now. Now through July 28th, you can find showtimes and tickets at ChesapeakeShakespeare.com. We'll be right back right after this. Stay tuned.